NK Telco Sports welcomes you to Wright State University, where the Wright State Lakers take on the Miami Hamilton Harriers. This game brought to you by Minster Bank, Keyhole Pizza, 21st Century Kitchens, Elmwood Assisted Living, Schwederman Pharmacy, New Knoxville Supply, Minster Dental Care, NK Telco, German Farmers Insurance, Wagner's IGA, Kogi Plumbing and Heating, Fowler's TV, Wilson Health, Orthopedic Associates of Southwest Ohio, Grand Lake Health Systems, First National Bank, Bud's Chrysler Dodge Jeep and Ram. This is an NK Telco Sports production. Welcome to Wright State Lake campus as we get set for volleyball action between the Wright State Lakers and the Hamilton University Hamilton Harriers. I'm Greg Burning. My partner this afternoon is Dave Helmstetter. Dave, the Lakers come in on a, with an 0-1 record after losing to Kent State. And the Harriers, who we saw a little bit earlier, defeated Kent State, and they are also 1-0. So we get set for a good matchup here this afternoon with uh, teams both having one, one match under their belt. Yeah, the Harriers, uh, a very intriguing kind of team, very aggressive, very, uh, very strong. And it's interesting to watch their coach, Sarah Dennis, on the sidelines. She uh, has got her team very much into it, and they're very much motivated. And it's uh, kind of an interesting experience just to, to watch right. her actions on the sideline. There you see Michelle Hardesty, the Lakers coach. And, of course, this is uh, only her second match. Her first year in action, her second match. And as Dave mentioned, uh, Sarah Dennis is coaching her sixth year now at the Harriers. So, uh, so let's talk about our keys in the game for tonight's match. First for Wright State. One of the things that we talked about in the uh, the first game uh, against Kent State for the Lakers is improved passing, Greg. Uh, Lakers just got to do a better job of, of setting each other up and, and moving the ball around. And the other thing is is consistency. You know, uh, they had some problems uh, serving inefficiencies and some things like that. Just got to play a little bit more consistent, which uh, obviously is a sign of probably a very young team. That's right. And then on the other side for the Harriers, Miami Hamilton, as we said in the very beginning, a very aggressive team, and uh, they need to continue that aggressive play and take it right to the Lakers. And then, of course, uh, limit their unforced errors, eliminate the mistakes, and uh, it looks like Miami Hamilton 1-0 with a pretty nice win over uh, Kent State Tuscarora in our uh, game earlier today. That's right. So you see the two teams exchange uh, friendly handshakes there before we get ready to start the match like our Keys of the Game sponsor was Bud's Chrysler Dodge Jeep Ram and Salina with a dealer makes a difference. Also like to thank our scoreboard sponsor, First National Bank, think first. One of the things here for the Lakers, they do have uh, Cami Hellworth out of uh, Parkway. She is here for this game and uh, looks like she's in the starting lineup number 15 for uh, the Lakers. Yeah, so quick recap, all we got a second. Our starters for Wright State, number five, Brooklyn Wambler. As Dave mentioned, number 15, Cammie Hallworth. Number 13, Hannah Scott. Number 12, Emily Ruinkamp. Number 19, Gabby Guerrero. And number 22, Reagan Hughes. On the other side of the net, the Miami University Hamilton Harriers. Number five, Michaela Dick. Number seven, Maggie Bruns. Number 12, Francesca Lindley. Number 14, Maddie Korsmeyer and number three, Jamie Kogan. As we get into match action here, first shot knocked down for the kill by Maddie Korsmeyer. As we talked about an aggressive play, there it is right out of the gate. Is Korsmeyer able to get the kill? That'll send Jamie Kogan back for our serve. Dug out there by Ruinkamp and bumped across by Hallsworth. Coming back on the attack, and the kill is number seven, Maggie Bruns, for the Harriers. So Harriers off to a good 2-0 start. Take a look at that again. There you see uh, Kors Meyer, and, or rather Bruns, and a nice shot there by her. Pump across over to Scott, blocked at the net, and dug out nicely by Michaela Dick. 
On the other side, the attack there by Hallsworth is deep and out of bounds. So Harry is off to a good start here, leading three to zero in set number one. Bump here by Hughes over to Hannah Scott. Nice shot dug up though nicely. Right at the net there was Cammie Hallworth trying to knock it over, can't get it to finish. Point to the Harriers. Serve dug out there again by Ruinkamp. Hughes with the set, bumped over by Hallworth. Dug out there, set up to number five, Michaela Dick, and early going here, Dave. The Harriers are rolling. Boy, they're on fire. Watch uh, Dick with this uh, with this kill here, boy, right into the open space and a point for uh, for Miami, and they lead five nothing. Going to serve there across by Kogan, set up middle to Hallsworth, dumped across and dug out by the Harriers, set across court. Back to number five, Dick, but dug out nicely by Ruinkamp. Hallsworth will bump it over and out of bounds. Six zero here to start out. There's a good shot of Kogan back to serve again. She started this game out with a bang. Nice dig by Ruinkamp, dumped over to Hallsworth. Hughes there bumped up into the net. A net violation will give the point to the Harriers. Bump set at the net over to Scott. She bumps it over. Dug out by the Harriers. Back to Michaela Dick and over to Hallsworth who's blocked at the net. Set right down the middle to number 14, Maddie Korsmeyer. That'll be a quick timeout for the Lakers. We'll take a break as well. You're watching Wright State Laker Volleyball on NK Telco Sports. Schwiedemann Pharmacies began serving the people of Auglaize County in 1916 when Urban Schwiedemann purchased the building and business from J.H. Hoffman. The New Bremen location is one of the longest running pharmacies in the country, with over 110 years of serving its patrons. Since then, four more stores have been added, Coldwater, St. Mary's, Minster, and Wapakoneta to round out the group. Our services include prescription refills, home medical equipment, nursing home services, customized compounded medication, vaccinations, and so much more. Welcome back to Wright State Lake Campus as uh, we're eight points into the first set here with the Harriers and the Lakers. And so far, Dave, it's been all Harriers. They've come out, fired up, and scored eight straight points in the 8-0. Yeah. Very, very strong play. We've got four kills already with two of them by Maddie Korsmeyer here in the early beginnings. Eight straight points by the Harriers, too. That one dug out, bumped back to the Lakers side. Here's Hannah Scott blocked at the net. Finally over to Hallsworth who bumps it across. Back at the net, here's another shot by number five, Michaela Dick, and it is just rolling well right now for the Harriers. Second kill for Dick. Jamie Kogan, still our server. Bumped over to Hannah Scott. Dug out there by Lindley and over to Dick. Three ball dumped across. Gonna be a good chance here for the Harriers. Back set over to number seven, Maggie Bruns, and she takes care of the rest. We talked about the aggressive play of, of Hamilton, and boy, they're just going right at the Lakers here in the uh, the first set here. There's a pass over to Halls. We're trying to get him going. Dug out though by the Harriers. Ball hit by 14 is Maddie Korsmeyer. And that one's tipped at the net. So another point for the Harriers. 11-0 run here for Miami University Hamilton.
Kogan serving once again, dug out by Ruinkamp, bumped up front to Wampler. She floats it across. Set up again over to Dick. That one is long and out of bounds. The Lakers are on the board. Wampler with the serve. Dug out, set over to Korsmeyer, hits that one wide and out of bounds. So two straight here now for the Lakers. They trail 11 to two here in the first set. Here's Seibel with the set. Dick with the hit, dug out by the Lakers. Over to Scott. Long and out of bounds point will go to the Harriers. Send Libero back to serve. Number six, Allie Graber. A little discussion with the coach and the official there. Not sure what that was about, but we're back to action. That one into the net from Graber. Back to serve is Guerrero. Miss hit there by Graver. Makes it 12 to four in favor of the Harriers. Wright State needing to get a couple here together, get their momentum going here a little bit in this game. As you mentioned, it's, it's been mostly Harriers taking control of the net. There's a big hit by Scott. Recovered though by the Harriers. Not hit by Lindley. And then we're gonna have a double hit by Hughes, so that'll give the point back to the Miami U University Harriers. Heard just checked in to serve for the Harriers. Service cross and is just long. Emily Rune can't back to serve for the Raiders. I'm sorry, the Lakers. She did a nice job in the match earlier today against Kent State. And dug out by Guerrero, bumped forward by Rune Camp, and free balled across. Free balled back by the Harriers. Good opportunity here for the Lakers. Right at the net and tipped over by Hughes for the point. Take a look at Reagan Hughes here, and there's the tip into the open space, and the Raiders pick up their fifth point of the night. Officials checking something at the scores table. Actually, it's scores. I think it's a scoring question. Yeah, not sure what they're looking at there, but. I think it should be. Thirteen six, but. Seems like they are got everything taken care of at the scores table. So there's Korsmeyer to serve for the Harriers. And she shoots a bullet across the line for an ace. Nice serve from Korsmeyer, our first ace of the match. The Harriers now with a 10 point advantage. Another solid serve dug out by Guerrero and tipped across by Scott. Here are the Harriers back on the attack. Number 12, Francisca Lindley with the kill. Yeah. 
Timeout taken by the Lakers. We'll take a, we'll stay here, talk about our sponsors, and thank them for today's action. Sweeterman's Pharmacy, New Knoxville Supply, Keyhole Pizza, Minster Bank, Minster Dental, NK Telco, German Farmers Insurance, Wagner's IGA, Kogi Plumbing and Heating, Fowler's TV, Wilson Health, Orthopedic Associates of Southwest Ohio, Grand Lake Health Systems, 21st Century Kitchens, and Elmwood Assisted Living. Thanks again to all those great sponsors for today's action. I'd also like to remind everyone that these, this game will be replayed on Sunday, August 28th at 4 p.m. and also on Monday, August 29th at 8 p.m. You can also watch the games on demand at nktelco.net. Dave, the Harriers got out to an early start. And they've stayed there. They were up 8-0, I believe, at one point, and now they've stretched that to an 11-point advantage. Yeah, the Harriers up to, to uh, well, 11, first 11 points were, were theirs, and with that kind of jump, that's where they're at now at 16-5, to five, and just continue to be so aggressive. Uh, Dick, Bruns, they both have two kills, and Korsmeyer's got three plus an ace, so some very good aggressive play by the Harriers. We've definitely had more stoppages already in this game. Uh, yes. Match, like officials checking something again, looking at substitutions and rotations, it looks like, and they were looking at the scorebook a little bit ago, so trying to get some clarity on a couple things, I, I would assume. In the meantime, it's kind of delaying our progress here as we you know, want to get back to action. Looks like everything's good though now. Coors Meyer back to serve with an 11-point advantage at 16-5 here in the first set. Dug out by Hallsworth. Tapped over to uh, Lucy Castro and fired back across by number three, Jamie Kogan for the kill. Meyer will settle back in at the service line. Another strong serve dug out by Hallsworth across the, over to the Harriers. Set over and dug out by Guerrero. Cross court pass to Ruin Camp. Can't get it across. Point to the Harriers. Korsmeyer again, dug out by Hallsworth. Nobody there to pick it up. We talked about one of the keys of the game is their passing, right? You can't have a pass from the back row go unattached to the front, so Lakers really need to get to that ball a little quicker. As again, another shot here from Korsmeyer, who's, who's serving very well. Dug out by Guerrero, set over to Castro, blocked again at the net by Kogan and finally drops for the Raiders. The Lakers, I'll get that. <laughs> <laughs> that sends Emily Ruinkamp back to serve for the Lakers. She's a strong server, dug out. Mishandled there by Graber, will give the point and ace to Emily Ruinkamp. Lakers had a lot of good success with Ruin Camp in the, the first uh, sets here this afternoon. Blocked there by Castro, again at the net by Castro. Then blocked twice by Kogan and finally comes away with the point. A lot more size on that front line for the Harriers. They have 5'11", 5'11", 5'10", 6'1", all in their front court. Mishandled serve there by the Lakers. Ace there to Francesca Lindley. And Lindley back to serve again. Four points shy of the first set victory. As that one falls, almost falls untouched. Quick set up front is out of bounds. Point to the Lakers. Twenty-one-eight here in the first set. 
Harriers on top. Lucy Castro back to serve for the Lakers. Good serve, gets a piece of the net. Back set over to Dick. Dug out by Ruinkamp and can't get it out of the net. Point to the Harriers. Couple substitutions, number seven, Maggie Bruns comes in. And also number 10 to serve Ashley Seibel. Seibel with the serve, is deep and out of bounds. Nice play there by Castro and Ruhnkamp to hide that one to the out of bounds line. And that will send Hughes back to the service line. A rotation violation there against the Lakers. Jamie Kogan, who started off the match back to serve, and a nice one she has there, a solid ace. That's kind of how the game started for the uh, Harriers. Kogan back there with her good serving. Yes, they're on set point here right now, 24 to nine. Kogan's got a couple of aces, a kill and a block, and quite a performance here in first set. Kogan with the dig, passed over to Dick. Cross court bump by Rune Camp, and that'll be it for the first set. All Harriers as they win 25 to 9. You're watching Wright State Lake Campus Volleyball on NK Telco Sports. If you want to save 70% on your heating, cooling, and hot water costs, the answer is right under your feet. Let New Knoxville Supply install a water furnace geothermal system and use the natural temperature from the earth for a more constant temperature in your home. Also ask about our new Symphony Home Management System. Control temperatures, track energy usage, and receive safety alerts for everything, including your sump pump. All from anywhere, anytime. Now is the time to calculate your savings at NewKnoxvilleSupply.com. Hi, I'm Mallory. My grandpa's been making the world's worst pizza for 30 years. That doesn't look like the world's worst pizza. Grandpa, I know why they call you Chunky Bob. It's because you use chunky ingredients on your pizza. Of course, it's not because I'm fat. Grandpa, this is the world's best pizza. Keyhole Pizza, come check Grandpa out. Dine in or carry out. Welcome back to Wright State Lake Campus as we get set for set number two with the Wright State Lakers and the Miami University Hamilton Harriers. First game went, first set, sorry, went to the Harriers 25 to nine. Dave, the Harriers came out strong and finished the game the same way. And yes, really and had the Lakers off balance right from the get go. Boy, just strong play overall by, by Hamilton. You take a look at some of the, the statistics. Uh, you know, they've got uh, two players with three kills, another one with two, and they've got four aces in the first game and just uh, some very strong, strong play overall by uh, the Harriers. So here we are, second set. Lakers hoping to turn things around here a little bit. This one's up, Seibel up front to Korsmeyer, dug out nicely by Guerrero. Miss hit though in the front row will give the point to the Harriers. Sends number three, I'm sorry, number six, Allie Graber back to serve for the Harriers. Dug out by Guerrero. Set at the net by Hughes is hit long by Scott. So the 2 0 here, just starting the second set. If you're just joining us, I'm Greg Burning, my partner Dave Helmstetter. We're just starting the second set here. First one won by the Harriers. That one dug out by Guerrero, set up front to Hannah Scott knocks it home. Good setup there by the Lakers there and able to come away with the point. Emily Ruinkamp back to serve for the Lakers. 
floater across, dug out by Graber. Quick set to Korsmeyer and she hammers it home. Korsmeyer had a very solid first game and she continues where she left off. Korsmeyer has got four kills so far in the, the two sets and an ace, just a dominating performance so far. I will send Cassidy Hurd back to serve for the Harriers. Serve dug out there by Castro. Set up front by Hughes, back to Castro. Blocked by Korsmeyer and Katie Sarber for the kill. Heard back to serve once again. Nice strong serve dug out by Guerrero. Hughes with the set over to Castro. Nice shot dug out though by Kogan. Castro back at the net again, picked up by the Harriers and blocked at the net by Scott. We got a four hit violation there against the Harriers. Nice job by the Lakers to come away with that point, trailing four to two here in set number two. Hannah Scott with the serve, dug out by Kogan. Free ball over to number 12, Lindley. Ball's out of bounds, I'm sorry, in for the point. Korsmeyer back to serve. Dug out by Camp. Pass over to Hellworth, tipped at the line and Gets the kill, got just enough of that one. Cami Hellworth picks up her first kill of the afternoon. Nice play and Wright State trails by two. Good serve there by Wampler, recovered. Hughes at the net, dumps it over to Hellworth who knocks it down the center and will get another kill. So Hellworth there with back to back. Boy, for the Lakers within one. For Wright State to be able to contend, that's the kind of play they got to get. Wampler back to serve. Will Floater in there, almost got him in. Nice save by Graber. Back up front to Hellworth, knocks it off another hand and gets the kill. Three straight there from Hellworth of the same variety. Just a smart play, putting it where nobody is, nobody was at. Another good serve by Wampler. Dug out by Guerrero. Set over to Castro who bumps it over. Korsmeyer up front to Kogan who knocks it down. Jamie Kogan with another kill for the Harriers. Kogan's uh, second kill of the afternoon. She's got two aces and a block to go with all that. So Kogan, as we said before, pretty outstanding player. Strong serve there by Lindley, dug out by Guerrero, up to Hellworth, knocks it down the spot, can't get it to go. Dick with the response, back set. Hellworth from the 10 foot line. Battling at the net, ball picked up by the Harriers. Here it is over to number eight for the kill, Katie Sarber. Second kill of the set for Sarber. Francesca Lindley back to serve. Too hard and out of bounds. Break there for the Lakers. They cut it to within one, seven, six here in set number two. That'll send Lucy Castro back to serve. Strong serve dug out by Graber. And the bump by Kogan dug out by Castro. Hellworth trying to knock it over. Hughes with the front set over to Ruinkamp. That one is deep and out of bounds. Little substitutions there in the game. Uh, Ashley Seibel for the Harriers back to serve. Also number seven, Maggie Bruns subbed in. Quick serve dug out by Guerrero. 
Get it over to Hellworth. She battles at the net, can't handle it. Point over to the Harriers. Kogan with the kill. Seibel again back to serve as they lead nine to six. Shot right at Guerrero. Hughes over to Ruin Camp. Dug out there by number five, Michaela Dick. Bumped over by Kogan and back over by Hellworth. Back at the net, here's Michaela Dick. That is well deep. Point to the Lakers. Guerrero back to serve for the Lakers. They trail nine to seven here in the second set. Quick set over to Dick, blocked at the net by Hannah Scott and Lucy Castro. I'm sorry, that's uh, Hughes. Reagan Hughes with the block. Lakers now down just by one, nine to eight here in set number two. Guerrero, strong serve, dug out by Graber. Seibel at the net to Kogan and she gets another kill. Jamie Kogan with a nice shot off the, the good set from, from Seibel. That'll send Jamie Kogan back to the service line with a 10-8 advantage. Strong serve cannot be handled by Wampler. Ace for Kogan. Good serve by Kogan, dug out by Castro. Ruin camp over to Scott. Scott can't get it around the antenna. Point will go to the Harriers. Raiders looking to get a little spark going here in the second set, trailing just by four. That one goes too far. Nice dig though there by Ruin Camp. And Castro with the kill. A nice rally there by the Raiders. Started from that extra effort by Ruin Camp. And Castro able to knock it home for the kill. Molly Burning will substitute in, replacing Wampler. Big kill there by Castro, stops a string of uh, three straight Miami points. Cross court pass to Korsmeyer, she can't get it across. Lakers back within two. Hughes back to the service line. Set by Seibel over to Dick. That one is deep and out of play. Nice run put together here by the Lakers. Gonna get a timeout by the Harriers. We'll take one as well. You're watching Wright State Laker Volleyball on NK Telco Sports. At Minster Bank, we understand that life can get hectic. That's why when it comes to your banking, we offer the services that make your life simpler with tools like person-to-person -person payments, pop money, mobile and online banking, and bill pay. But most of all, Minster Bank is a supportive member of your community with personal relationships and customer service that reach outside of our branches. Minster Bank, helping people achieve financial success. Welcome back to Salina as we get back to second set action here. The Lakers losing the first set 25 to nine to the Harus. Only trailing by one here in the second. And back to serve is Reagan Hughes for the Lakers. Serve dug out by Lindley, backs that over to Dick and she knocks it home. Michaela Dick having a nice afternoon. Number one for the Harriers, Sierra Lee comes in the ball game. And Graber back to serve. Dick has four kills here in the first two, two sets. Three ball to cross, an attempt to cross by Hughes there, doesn't make it, point goes to the Harriers.
Graber with the serve, dug out by Guerrero. Hughes, and now Molly Burning. Dug out by Graber, pass over to Lindley, blocked at the net. Back to Lindley, dug out by Hughes. Tipped at the net, dug out by the Harriers. Back set, not handled by Lee, and out of bounds, point to the Lakers. Emily Roonkamp to the service line for the Lakers. Graber with the dig. Set right down the middle of Korsmeyer, dug out by Roonkamp. Hughes. Hughes with the double hit there on the set. 15-12 advantage now for the Harriers. As Hurd and Soiber come back in for the Harriers. Served by Hurd is good enough. She gets the point. Hurd again with a nice solid serve. Hughes right to the middle of Burning. And Burning will get the kill. Scott with the serve, dug out by Lindley. Right back to Lindley. Set from Hughes over to Hellworth. Hellworth dug out by Graber. Heard. 10 foot line shot from, Lo from uh, Kogan, I'm sorry. Back the other way is Castro. Back and forth we go in this battle. That was going to go out of bounds off of Lindley. Point to the Lakers. Good service volley there and able to come away with the big point. 16-14, Lakers trailing just by two. Another good strong serve by Hannah Scott. Right at the net to Korsmeyer. Hughes able to get a hand on it. Back over to Lindley. That one is gonna be well long, and the Lakers within one. Big point here for, uh, for Wright State. The Lake Campus hasn't tied this one in a long time. Heard Korsmeyer at the net with the kill. Guerrero comes back in for the Lakers. Maddie Korsmeyer with the serve, just cuts the tape and comes up with the ace. Big serve by the freshman, 6-1 Korsmeyer. In Turpin, Ohio. Another strong serve, dug out by Castro. Hughes and now free balled over by Ruinkamp. Heard with the cross court set to Lindley, can't handle it. Point for Wright State. Wampler will check back in. Wampler back to serve. Dug out by Lindley, quick set. Kogan. Over to Castro, blocked at the net. Nice dig by Guerrero, Hughes, and free balled over by Hellworth. Over to Lindley, Lindley with the open shot. Nice recovery by Ruinkamp. 10 foot line shot from Ruinkamp. Heard, Kogan blocked by Hellworth. Kogan again, back row shot, count it. Fifth kill of the afternoon for Kogan. Timeout on the floor. We'll take one as well. You're watching Wright State Laker Volleyball on NK Telco Sports. 
You owe it to yourself twice a year at checkup at Minster Dental Care. Our specialized doctors, Jim Overman, Jim Myring, Sean Sharp, and Philip Slonkowski are ready to give you the smile you've always dreamed of at any stage of your life. Pediatric, orthodontic, restorative, and cosmetic dentistry are just a few of the services offered. Our latest advancements include Seric Dentistry that allows us to create and deliver a crown in one convenient visit. We're located on State Route 66 in Minster, 419-628-3380 to schedule your appointment today. You owe it to yourself. The Harriers. The Harriers also won the first set, 25 to nine. Today the Lakers trying to battle back into this second set. It's gonna be a big point here. That, the Harriers get up to 20, it'll be tough to recover from. Yeah, they pulled it to 16 to 15 and with the serve, but not able to tie it up and they went the other direction. And a good serve point there for the Harriers. We'll put them right there where I just said at 20 to 16. Now they'll send Lindley back to the, the service line. Dug out by Wampler. Pass right up front to Hellworth, dug out by Korsmeyer, and now here's Dick with a soft tap across. Back up to Castro. Heard over to Dick, blocked at the net, but out of bounds off of a Laker point Harriers. Lindley back to serve. 21-16, Harriers. Guerrero, Hughes. And that one knocked home by the overshot from two Jamie Kogan who comes away with the kill. Quick timeout, we'll keep it right here. I'd like to thank our sponsors again for today's action. Sweeterman Pharmacy, New Knoxville Supply, Keyhole Pizza, Minster Bank, Minster Dental, NK Telco. German Farmers Insurance, Wagner's IGA, Kogi Plumbing and Heating, Fowler's TV, Wilson Health, Orthopedic Associate of Southwest Ohio, Grand Lake Health Systems, 21st Century Kitchens, and Elmwood Assisted Living. Thanks again to all those wonderful sponsors. In case you want to see a replay of this game, it'll also be on Sunday, August 28th at 4 p.m. and Monday, August 29th at 8 p.m. These games can be seen on NK Telco Cable Channel 3 or in HD on Channel 503. Back to action, 22-16, Harriers on top. Lindley serving, dug out by Guerrero. Hughes over to Hellworth, blocked at the net and dug out by Graber. Back to Kogan, and there it is, Jamie Kogan. Kogan has uh, six kills here in this set. Seven overall, 14 kills for Hamilton just in this set as they uh, have the big edge over the Lakers, 14 to nine in that category. Quick hit there by the Lakers, dug out by Graber. Kogan will free ball it across. Hughes with the set over to Castro. Back up front to Kogan. Dickey with the shot at Hellworth. And Dickey coming away with the battle there to put the set point here for the Harriers at 24-16. Another good serve by Lindley. And free ball across by Hellworth. Quick set to Kogan, forget it, it's over. That's a heck of a hit again by her. She had a heck of a game. What a performance by Jamie Kogan. Second set goes to the Harriers 25-16. We'll take a quick break and be back with set number three. You're watching Wright State Laker Volleyball on NK Telco Sports. As a father of two teenage daughters and husband to a lovely wife, thanks, hon, it is important for me to look out for myself and my family. Fiber is one of the most important things in my day. Fiber keeps me healthy, sane, and stress-free. NK Telco Fiber, fast and reliable, keeping our household sane by keeping their devices connected. NK Telco, providing services that bring value to your everyday life. 
When I took over this farm from my dad, I knew our future success required making major changes in our operations. That meant adding acreage, more and bigger equipment, investing in powerful technology, hiring employees. We even started a seed business. Fortunately, working together with Grinnell Mutual and my local farm mutual, my agent was able to cover everything. I call that progress. Wegner's IGA have been servicing their communities for more than 90 years, spanning three generations. Wegner's founded their business on two basic principles, excellent customer service and quality products. Visit all our locations and experience the finest selection of deli, fresh meats, and a variety of beverage choices. While there, don't forget to check out our vast selection of fresh coffee beans, produce, dairy, and bakery items. Visit Wegner's today in Minster, Fort Larmy, and New Bremen. Set number three, the first two in convincing fashion have went to the Harriers, 25-9 and 25-16. Lakers looking to put some run of points together here to start this second or a third one. Very they, much a dominating performance by Jamie Kogan, Greg. Uh, yeah. Seven kills out of the 15 that her team had in the second set. Uh, add in uh, an ace and quite a performance in that second set. And she's starting the third off back at that service line. Castro on the floater across. Here's Seibel over to Dick, dug out by Castro. Guerrero up to the front row, knocked across by Ruinkamp. Hopefully the Lakers can get a better start this time because the first two games, the Harriers have got off to big leads and just kind of played even after that. Another serve by Kogan, dug out by Guerrero. Over to Scott, miss hit, and point into the net for the Harriers. Kogan again back to the service line. Strong serve, nice dig by Guerrero. Free ball shot by Castro, dug out by Lindley. And we got a... Not sure what the call there was. Miss hit at the net, I think. Or hit into the net. Point over to the Harriers. With a 3-0 advantage here in set number three. Kogan, ace right down the gut. It's her fourth ace of the uh, afternoon. Hogan with another very nice serve and another ace. Again, the Harriers able to get out to a nice start here as they have a 5-0 advantage, all courtesy of Jamie Kogan. Nice dig there by Castro, and again by Castro. Back up front to Scott, dug out by Kogan. Quick set to Korsmeyer, can't get it across. Lakers on the board, five to one. Emily Ruin can't back to serve for the Lakers. Kogan up to the front line to Seibel. Nice set to Korsmeyer, down it goes. That's what volleyball is supposed to look like right there. That was nice. Perfect pass up to the front row. Good set from Seibel and Korsmeyer knocks it home. Korsmeyer in the two previous sets now with that one is seven total kills. Very consistent performer for uh, the Harriers. Graber back to serve. Dug out nicely by Ruinkamp. Over to Scott. Scott with a strong hit. Dug out nicely by Kogan. Kogan back at the 10 foot line, calling for it. Dug up by the Lakers, over to Burning. Burning taps it across, Seibel with the set, back to Lindley. Lindley down the line, but out of bounds. Very good possession there by the Lakers. Couple real nice sets, and able to hold on for the point. As they trail six to two here in the third.
Ayla Scott back to serve. Dug out by number one, Lee. Lee knocks it across, dug out there by Ruinkamp. Burning can't quite get it across. There was a violation right before that. So points to the Harriers. As Hurd and Graber check in. And also on the other side, Hellworth checked in for the Lakers. Bird with a nice serve. And nobody can handle it. Another good service point for the Harriers. Dug out by Guerrero. Free ball across by Ruinkamp. Heard, nice set to Korsmai. Dug out though by Ruinkamp. Got a four hit call against the Harriers. I'm sorry, against the Lakers. Quick timeout by the Lakers. We'll take a quick break as well. You watch a Wright State Laker volleyball on NK Telco Sports. Kogi Plumbing and Heating is your Bryant Factory authorized dealer. We have brought the best of comfort, control, and plumbing services to the St. Mary's area for over 60 years. We have been Reader's Choice winners for the last four years running and excel at providing our customers with efficient and reliable heating and air conditioning as well as responsive service when a plumbing emergency arises. We insist that the products we install in our customers' homes and businesses offer the same performance and value that we expect ourselves. Call today for your next plumbing and heating or air conditioning needs. Bryant, whatever it takes. Welcome back to Wright State Lake Campus, set number three. You're just joining us, I'm Greg Burning, my partner Dave Helmstetter is the Hamilton Harriers of Miami University, won the first two sets, 25-9, 25-16, and we're in set number three, and the Harriers are ahead, nine to two. Heard with the service, dug up by Guerrero. Down the middle is a nice shot by Castro, but dug out. And that one is long off of Korsmeyer. Point will go to the Lakers. Now we'll send Molly Burning back to the service line for the Lakers and she will be rotated for Wampler. Brooklyn Wampler coming in to serve. And that one goes right into the net from Wampler. Ten to three on the service there. That'll send Korsmeyer to the service line for the Harriers. Dug out by Ruinkamp. I'll score past the Castro. Castro, and she knocks it home. Nice shot. And Lucy Castro for the kill. Stop here on the other side for some moisture on the floor. Ten four in favor of the Hamilton Harriers. Lucy Castro with the serve. Picked up by Graber, bumped over to Kogan who frees it across. This will be free back by Camp, dug up by Korsmeyer. Heard over to Lindley, and Lindley will get the kill. Nice shot there from Francesca Lindley. Michaela Dick will enter back in for the Harriers. Service there by Lindley is untouched, ace. A little miscommunication in the back row there by the Lakers. And a strong serve there by Lindley. Free ball to cross by Hellworth and out of bounds.
13 to four in favor of the Harriers. Lindley back to serve. Gets a little bit of the tape. Nice save there by Castro. And Wampla can't get it across. Ten point advantage now for the Harriers. That one knocked across by Wampler. Quick set over to Ruin Camp, dug out by Graber. Heard right at the net, sets it up for Kogan, and she'll take care of it from there. Jamie Kogan again with another kill. Not much doubt when she has an opportunity. She racks up another kill for uh, the Harriers. Strong serve there, dug out by Wampler. A lack of communication there as the ball drops untouched. Couple substitutions, number three. Number three for the Lakers, Taj Palmer checks in. As the tip of the net hit there by Lindley. Point for the Lakers. Kenneth Scott will check in. And Guerrero back to serve as Lakers trail 16 to five. Miss hit there by Hurd as the ball goes out of bounds. Point to the Lakers. Gabby Guerrero back to serve. Set number three, 16 to six in favor of the Harriers from Ham Miami University in Hamilton, Ohio. Couple substitutions, number seven, Maggie Bruns, and number 10, Ashley Seib will come in for the Harriers. Serve from Seibel, dug out by Guerrero, right up front to Scott. And free ball to cross by Lindley. Nice dig by Guerrero. Upset up top there to Hannah Scott blocked. Back to net blocked again, this time by number seven, Maggie Bruns for the kill. For the Harriers, this looks like game number one and they can do no wrong. As they now have a 12 point advantage, 18 to six. Seibel knocks that one into the net, break for the Lakers. That'll send Brooklyn, I'm sorry, Reagan Hughes back to the service line. Dug out by Lindley, quick set at the net to Kogan and it falls. Not the prettiest kill, but Jamie Kogan with another one. Time out on the floor. We'll take a quick break as well. You're watching Wright State Laker Volleyball on NK Telco Sports. Take your game day party to the next level with a new TV and Sono sound system from Fowler's TV in St. Mary's. A Sono system takes the action into every room of your home and outdoors. Break your home into zones and control the content and level right from your phone or tablet, enabling you to enjoy the game or not with the touch of a finger. Add a security camera system connected to your TV from Valor's and never leave another friend stuck outside in the cold. Valor's TV, taking game day to the next level. There's a good shot of first year coach Michelle Hardesty for the Wright State Lakers. They're trailing here in the third set, 19 to seven. And a nice shot there from Hannah Scott. A little shot to the arm to get the Lakers going here a little bit. Been a definitely a difficult set for, uh, for Wright State, the Lakers. Only two kills so far in this set. Emily Ruin can't back to serve. And there's a good one, that's an ace for the Lakers. Nice little floater dropped in there. Yeah. 
Moon camp again, that one dug out by Lindley. Set up to Korsmeyer right down the middle. Wasn't the strongest hit in the world, but she hit it where nobody was standing. Sierra Lee will check back in, as well as Graber for the Harriers. As they lead 20 to nine here in the third set. Guerrero struggled with the ball, tracked down by Camp and free balled across, but didn't make it, hits the top. It's a good shot there to get it across by Kennedy Swan. Unfortunately for her, it hit the, hit the beam in the ceiling. And when it's going across the net, that makes that ball dead and point goes over to the Harriers. Free ball knocked across by Castro. Seibel over to Korsmeyer, back row, good. Maddie Korsmeyer, three kills here in this uh, third set. In the afternoon, she has uh, nine kills so far. Graber with a good serve. Dug out tempo there by Castro, but Swan unable to track it down. 23-9 here in favor of the Harriers here in the third set. Graber again with the serve. Dug out by the Lakers and free ball across, but out of bounds. So we're at set and match point here for the Harriers. Graber again with the serve, and that one is deep and out of bounds. Hannah Scott back to serve for the Lakers. Free ball from the 10 foot line by Kogan, dug out by Ruinkamp. Hellworth trying to tip it across, cannot. And that will be the set and the match as the Harriers win that one 25 to 10. We'll take a quick break and be back with our post game and recap. You're watching Wright State Laker Volleyball on NK Telco Sports. At Wilson Health, we're extending care beyond the walls of the hospital with resources designed to keep you in charge of your health. Our independence and connection to the community are unique in a world where big healthcare strives to act like corporations. Our tools may be the same, but we are different. We're neighbors, friends, and family who truly care about the people who live here. We call it caring without limits, and it's just the beginning of a whole new Wilson Health. I happened to pivot wrong and hurt my knee. I ended up tearing my ACL. It hit me pretty hard because I, I love playing lacrosse. I met my surgeon and he made me feel confident about being able to get back into playing lacrosse. They always just took such good care of me and they really were confident in what they were doing, which made me feel confident that I would be able to get back to playing lacrosse. In the Grand Lake Health System, great health care is about creating a personalized experience. We're here for you at every stage of your life to care for you with compassion and courtesy, to support you with an honest approach that values communication and actively seeks your collaboration, to treat you in a safe, welcoming environment where quality and service always come first, to create truly grand experiences. For more, visit grandlakehealth.org slash grand experience. At 21st Century Kitchens, we know that every home has a style to go with it. From first time home buyers, to families with the pitter patter of little feet, to teenagers taking over the kitchen, 21st Century has what you want customizing the style, layout, and price point to fit your budget. Kitchens by Craftmade and Quality Cabinets, countertops by Wilson Art and Cambria, along with availability of granite, marble, and wood. See what's in store behind the yellow door for your 21st Century Kitchen. Dad, I think that this is the right choice. Huh. It's not safe anymore, you all alone in the house. Let 
the fun begin. Elmwood, a lifestyle for everyone. Welcome back to Wright State Lake Campus as we just completed our match. The Hamilton Univers uh, Miami University Hamilton Harriers victorious over the Wright State Lakers in three sets, 25-9, 25-16, and 25-10. Dave, it was uh, uh, kind of a rough afternoon, if you will, for the Lakers early in their season, just their second match in, but uh, the Harriers came to play. Yeah, kind of a baptism of fire for the Wright State University Lake Campus. Lakers, uh, Miami University Hamilton established program six years, and uh, obviously as you watched uh, the sets here this afternoon, you could could see that, and if you take a look at the numbers, uh, pretty dominant on the part of uh, Miami University Hamilton. 32 kills in all three sets compared to 13 kills for Wright State. Uh, right there tells you, you know, the aggressive play that we talked about. Uh, that Miami University Hamilton continued that from uh, their win earlier this afternoon over Kent State Tuscarora. Uh, two outstanding performers on Miami University Hamilton squad. Uh, uh, Jamie Kogan just had an outstanding uh, afternoon. Uh, ended up uh, their leader with kills and followed closely there by Maddie Korsmeyer, who uh, also had an equally strong game. And those two uh, young ladies uh, are were really, in my mind, the bulk of the uh, the attack for right. Miami University Hamilton and a uh, little bit more firepower than the Lakers have at the current time. Yep, good thing is just two games into their season, so a lot of time to improve. Young program, as you mentioned. And uh, they'll get there. It just takes a little bit of time, and you gotta you got to grow a little bit before you can get to the top. So learning experience all the way around for uh, Wright State University Lake Campus, and uh, certainly uh, I'm sure we'll see in the future some improvement from them. Absolutely. It's a good afternoon here at volleyball. That's going to do it for us here today. I'd like to thank our director, Isaac Sell, assistant director, Bryce Hamrick, our camera person, Tyler Wolf, my partner, Dave Helmstetter. I'm Greg Burning. Thanks for watching, and have a great evening.